Well, to be honest, I really got much to add. The fellas said a lot, so <clears throat> just want to wish the fellas all the best. You know, we've got a great group of guys here. The fellas been putting in a lot of work, so good luck. Have a good one. Yes, gentlemen, um, it's a pleasure to be here as well. Obviously, looking at you know all the young men in here, you know I've been, I've seen you guys grow up from from all the Nadine cricketers to big men, and now sitting down here in the same room with you guys playing and World Cup. So I just want to wish you guys all the best. You know my advice to you fellas is just stick together, play as a team. Uh, like Rostin said, you know obviously guys will come at us hard, but the important thing is for us to play hard and play hard together. You know we practice well. You know we put in a lot of work over the last two weeks. You know, the guys that ran APL, they showed they were working as well. So it's important that we, you know, we come together and practice with a purpose and stick and play hard cricket. All right, play as a team and we definitely will win this competition. Thank you. World Cup cricket is always a special moment for me because I made my debut in T20 cricket in the World Cup. Mm. So it was always a special feeling for me and quite funny because I never thought that I would play a T20 World Cup before I play a 50 over World Cup. So it was special and funny for me at the same time. But I mean, the first one when I played, it was more with like some senior guys, Chris Gill, Bravo, and that. So I mean, the team wasn't as close because to me, it had a big gap with like a lot of the players and stuff. But I think that this team is, I don't want to say a better team, but I mean, is a to me, it's more family and is more playing with my friends and people that I grew up playing with. So I think it's more special to me and also because it's at home. Um, just coming from Jamaica, just know the feeling. I mean, the workout hasn't started yet, but the feeling there was amazing with the fans, the crowd, how they really cheered for us. And like Puran said, like playing at home, like everybody gonna be watching you. Everybody gonna be hoping for West Indies to win. So, I mean, people could um, see that as pressure, but I just see that as an opportunity to just go out there and entertain. I just want all the guys to, uh, as John said, keep your calm, keep your composure. I mean, everybody's gonna be watching, but just take it as an opportunity to, to, to um, create a brand for yourself. Put your name up there. If you're not, Getting millions, like Captain said, he's a millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> this is the time that, you know what I mean? If you Shots don't get a million, right? get a half a million. You know what I mean? Just go out there, play with pride, play with passion, and just want every moment to, to, to be yours. So I just want to wish all the guys good luck. I mean, for the past three years or two years that I've been in the team, I mean, we've been playing good cricket. When I first came into the team, Avi would always talk about the road to the World Cup. This is what we need to do. And I think we've been making great strides, especially like in the areas we, we um, say were our weaker areas. I think that the players really took it upon themselves to find the work and improve in those areas. So it's just for us to continue striving. And I think we have everything that it takes to win. Everything that it takes to win. So just go out there, enjoy the cricket, enjoy each other's success. And I mean, it's a World Cup. You may lose one or two games. If you win as a team, you got to lose as a team. I think something that we tend to do, we tend to, when we start to lose, we start to separate and point fingers but if we can win we got to stay together despite whatever may happen and that's how we can come out on top so good luck to all the guys backing each and every one of you guys 100 percent and we got what it takes guys